India actually integrated its entire grid. That means there's a one common grid for the entire country. So any energy sold in Tamil Nadu can be bought in some other state in another part of the country, and you can figure out how to um, make energy flows happen. So it's not like they're all disconnected pieces. Sometimes you can also take advantage of the different geographies, uh, places that there's abundant solar, may not need the energy, they can actually ship it to parts that need the energy. Can you have a person who's got, say, a solar panel and wants to sell that energy to a person who's got an electric wake? Uh, can we do that? How do we do that? And I think that conversation is being had uh, internally. There's something called the unified energy interface, which is, again, the question of that protocol being talked about, is can you have a protocol that all providers and all recipients will use that protocol to exchange information about energy products and also exchange information about transactions, which is you now use the uh, financial network to finish the transaction, right? So you've, you've transacted on this on the energy side and then you use this to transaction on the, uh, on, on, on the money side.